Hey guys, this is Mike Tarallo with Click, and in this video, I'm going to share some quick tips that you should be aware of before using Click AutoML. For a brief overview and demo of Click AutoML, please see our other video resources on the Click and Click Help YouTube channels. Tip number two will cover the data you should be using with Click AutoML. When creating a new ML experiment with Click AutoML, you are prompted to select data from the Click catalog. Though you will see data that has been registered in the catalog, it is important to note that not just any data can be used with Click AutoML. Historical data, data you normally use for analytics and reporting with dimensions, measures, time periods, etc., is generally not suitable for machine learning. Why? Data you are accustomed to using in apps is captured all at the same point in time, current, end of day, end of month, etc. With machine learning and predictive analytics, the dataset needs to contain an outcome we care about and a set of attributes we call features that existed prior to that outcome. That way, a machine learning model can learn the patterns that led to that outcome and therefore identify them in advance when we apply the model to the live data. That being said, you must select data from the catalog that has been prepared with the main ingredients needed to train machine learning models. Tip number three will cover architecting this dataset and the needed ingredients.